Hello there guys and welcome to How To Meals. This episode is going to be a request video. We received a request from the user called Some Other Name, requesting to suggest a couple of dishes that you can make in 10 to 15 minutes uh, when you had a long day of work. First of all, I'm just going to say it as a side note. I strongly recommend to look up some uh, meal preps and that saves a lot of time during the week. When you come home, you can just take a Tupperware box filled with food and just reheat it and you have a perfect fine meal but since you don't always have time to meal prep I thought I'm going to make a burrito for you rice is probably the only long thing in this recipe but you can also pre-cook it the day before or use some leftover rice and it's also perfectly doable in a microwave oh yeah this week's audio is brought to you by Marseille soap <laughs> we're not sponsored by it so I hope that you enjoy this episode so what you'll need for this recipe is rice. I've pre-cooked some brown rice to make it a bit more healthy. You can either make this rice in a microwave or just let it cook on the fire. So you can just let the rice cook and prepare the rest of your dish. If you have some leftover rice, you can also use that. It's not as tasty, but it's quite handy. Eggs. I'm going to use roughly three eggs for this. It really depends on how hungry you are. Some beans. I'm going to be using some red beans in chili sauce because they didn't have any black beans in the store. Again, your own preference. One avocado, some salsa for the flavoring, pepper and salt. And finally, a tortilla to wrap your burrito in. Let's do this. So first of all, we're going to prepare our avocado. It's pretty straightforward. Cut it in two. Twist. Ooh, that's one large seed. Pop the seed out. Wow. And I'm just going to slice it up into slices in the shell. Pretty straightforward trick that you've probably seen a hundred, maybe a thousand times on the internet. There you go. And I'm just going to close the avocado back up again to keep it fresh until I'm going to use it for the burrito. Let's move on to the eggs. For the eggs, you just want to scramble them or just fry it the way you like. Pretty straightforward. And there you go. Your eggs are done. And now we can start assembling the burrito. So for the assembly, I've heated up my tortilla in a microwave for roughly 20 to 30 seconds. And now we can start adding everything on there. I'm going to start with a little bit of rice, a little bit of egg, a little bit of salsa, some beans, maybe just a little bit more rice. And finally, the avocado. I'm just going to scoop it out with a spoon and just put it on top. Now, here comes the fun part, the rolling. Take your side flaps, roll them inside, roll your burrito over, then just pull everything back and roll it further. If you have larger leaves, it's a bit easier to do, but this is the best that I can do with this uh, size because it usually falls apart a bit. I like to take a little bit of aluminum foil and just wrap the whole thing so that it stays nice together and still a bit warm. You can also heat up your beans if you want to. And there you go. I roughly used a quarter of the avocado and I still have enough egg for another burrito. So I'm just going to say this recipe is is definitely enough for two burritos at least. You can either unpack it and eat it like that, but I also like to cut it in two for the presentation. And there you go. You have yourself a nice, okay, healthy burrito. So thank you guys for watching this episode. I really hope that you enjoyed it. And I hope that you found this recipe useful. If you have something that you like to make after a long work day that is quite easy or after a long day of studying. Let me know in the comment section below. Maybe you can help other people or who knows, I'm going to make an episode on your dish. But now I'm going to eat my burritos. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next. Good boy.